Sunshine Valley, Idaho, which is a place I spent time in growing up. Before starting the site, I had never thought about grass and how grass really isn't very environmentally friendly. So coming back, I was really shocked that like so many places in the US, there seems to be grass everywhere and everybody turns on the sprinklers and mows it. I don't find the usefulness of grass. It's not especially beautiful. It has like an artificial green. It requires a lot of water. It's like the typical response of the human being against the environment. It's really hot here, but I swear I'm gonna have a really green lawn. You think somebody who wants to come to Sun Valley because it's back to nature, it's beautiful, why would they put lawns in when they can put some other type of landscaping in that, that represents the beauty of the, of the area? All right, so a little more natural around here. I think this is more beautiful, and I think other people would agree if you just start thinking in that way, that like you don't have to tame your backyard, that this... I mean, look, any of this stuff is pretty. There's even flowers growing naturally. There's like what grows, wildflowers, they'll come up. There's a lupin for you. You want that lupin, sweetheart? Yeah. You like the native plants, Nessie? Lupins are a wonderful thing to plant in an area like this because they put nitrogen back in the soil, which is what is really necessary for growth for most things. Lawns consume a tremendous amount of nitrogen. You buy it. They make it out of oil products, and it's just a shame because why not just let nature take care of it? It's a complete cycle that way. This landscaping, I think, really is fitted for this area. You see, nature is taking care of itself. I don't think they want over here. You have a certain amount of flowers at various times that come up. We're out in the country, and that's not what you want to see when you go out in the country. What are the lawns good for, unless you're actually going to go out there and play some soccer or football? And then you can have a nice little patch someplace. As much time as we've spent up here and seeing the grass, I don't know if I've ever seen anybody on it except for a friend's wedding. It's not used. Historically, lawns were a means of conspicuous consumption, a way to prove that you had enough money to waste it, instead of planting things that were useful like agricultural products. So really, the roots of lawns is a way of wasting your money. You know, I think times are changing, and I don't think people really want to see that you can waste things and, and hurt the environment.